What's going on guys? I'm here with Coach Espo and we're gonna do a quick video on how to do some like trigger point release with a foam roller on your muscles that if you're feeling sore or just discomfort or anything after a hard practice or game, here's how to get a little bit of uh, uh, discomfort out of the system. So what we wanna go over is the way that we're gonna do it no matter what the muscle is, all right? So uh, we're gonna use her calf as an example here. So Christina, what I want you to do is go ahead and put that foot over that leg there. And I want you to pop your butt up off the floor. And what we're gonna start with is just back and forth 10 times. So find the area that's feeling a little cranky and we're gonna go 10 times back and forth over it. And I want you to try this really quick. Scoot yourself forward a little bit more and try not to bend your knee when you go and do it. So it's just your whole body moves as one. Yeah. So we're just gonna do that 10 times. Now, Christina, I want you to take the spot that hurt the most, find that, and now she's gonna go 10 times side to side on it. Bonus points, yep, if the hips are off the ground, slow and controlled, breathe during it, 10 times total. And now once she's done with that, in that range, find the spot that hurt the most, go ahead. And now we're going to hold that position, point your toe out, and then pull it back in 10 times. Good, 10 times total. And now let's show them, say you have your IT band, right? Your IT band's feeling a little cranky. We're gonna go onto the side there, and how I want you to picture it is, just put your IT band, cut it in half, and have either the lower half or the upper. And if that discomfort area is in the lower or upper, so where is yours, more upper or lower, would you say? Upper. So she's just gonna focus on the upper part here. So we're gonna work from the top of the hip to midway through the leg. She's gonna lay on the side here with it, go ahead and cross that leg over, and we're gonna repeat the same thing. So we're just gonna go 10 up and down, nice and easy there, good. And again, once she finds, once she's done with it and she's done with those 10, you're gonna find the spot that just hurt the most and you're gonna pin it down and now go side to side with it 10 times. And this one, you might feel some muscles moving around your leg or it might feel kind of weird. Just let it happen, breathe. And one thing I like to say too, which is important no matter what we're doing with the foam roller, no pain faces. You have to almost trick your brain into thinking you're relaxing here. From here, again, the spot that kind of you know, hurt the most, and now we're gonna to try to bend our knee to get our heel to our butt and then back out, 10 times total. And breathe and no pain face it. Trick that brain into thinking we're having a great time here. We're gonna let those muscles relax. So again, you could do those three uh, anywhere on the body that you might be feeling a little cranky, sore, or whatever. If you have your tricep, you could put a softball on a bench, same thing, up and down, side to side, bend the arm. You can do that to the front of the quads, you can do it to your glutes, all the same. Um, any questions with that? No. Sick. So, if you have any questions, go ahead and shoot me an email, mike at stokeathletics.com, and I'll talk to you soon.